I'm Detective Scott. Detectives look for clues to solve puzzles. Did you know that readers and writers also look for clues? When we do this, we become word detectives. Words have clues that can help us figure out their meanings. Suffixes are parts of words that come at the end of a word. Sometimes suffixes have meaning and can change the meaning of an entire word. Today, we are going to explore the suffix less. Can you figure out what this suffix might mean from these two examples? Marco could not see the gas because it was colorless. The gas was without color. Marco was joyless when his soccer team lost the game. He was without joy. So, word detectives, what do you think the suffix less might mean? If you said without, you figured it out. Less is a suffix. It attaches to the end of root words, and it means without. When we add the suffix less to a root word, we build a new word. Let's explore this together. Marco was tired, panting, and without breath. After he ran the long race, Marco was blank. If you said breathless, you cracked the case, detective. Breathless means without breath. You might feel breathless after you run a race. You might also feel breathless if you get a surprise. You might feel breathless if your mom or dad surprise you with a new puppy or a kitten. You feel so astonished you are breathless without breath. Let's try another one. Marco tossed and turned all night. He could not fall asleep. Marco spent the whole night without sleep. Marco spent a blank night. If you said sleepless, you cracked the case, detective. Sleepless means without sleep. You might have a sleepless night if you can't get any rest. You might feel exhausted after a sleepless night. A night without sleep. Don't miss our next lesson as we explore how the suffixes full and less make words that are antonyms.